Bismillahirrahmanirrahim. Alhamdulillahi rabbil alamin. Wassalatu wassalamu ala sayyidil mursalin sayyidina Muhammad wa alihi wa sahbihi wa sallam tasliman kathira. Assalamu alaykum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh. This is Imam Sayyid Shakir on behalf of Ta'dif Collective and I'm here to greet all of my wonderful brothers and sisters during the middle of Ramadan. So we've reached the halfway point, so point of Ramadan or close to that point and I'm urging you brothers and sisters, let's bring it home. Let's bring it home in fine fashion. Let the end of the month be the best of the month. Actions are judged on their last and may the last of Ramadan be the very, very best of this very special month. The month of fasting, the month of Quran, the month of spending, the month of community. The community is coming together for iftars, we're coming together for taraweeh, we're coming together on the night of power, which lies in the last half of this month in the strongest opinions. So let's enjoy all of that and let's enjoy it to the very last. The Prophet وسلم, reminded us من صام رمضان إيمانا واحتسابا غفر له ما تقدم من ذنبه Whoever fast during the month of Ramadan with sincere faith anticipating a reward their prior sins will be forgiven ومن قام رمضان إيمانا واحتسابا غفر له ما تقدم من ذنبه And whoever stands for prayer during the nights of Ramadan with sincere faith anticipating a, ro- a reward their prior sins will be forgiven. So brothers and sisters, let's take advantage of this opportunity, fasting and standing for prayer during the entire month, Man Kama Ramadan, Man Sama Ramadan. There are many brothers and sisters out there, primarily sisters who might be nursing, and because of that they can't fast, or who might be in post-childbirth uh, uh, period where they can't fast, or for other reasons, but we want to remind everyone out there, especially those who might be in this particular category, that the blessings of Ramadan are there for everyone to enjoy. The blessings of Ramadan extend throughout the month and they extend to every member of this Ummah. The deeds are multiplied. Maybe you can't fast, but you can read Quran, for example, a nursing uh, mother, and that reward is multiplied all the more. Maybe you can't read the Quran, nor can you fast, but you can say Subhanallah, Walhamdulillah, Walla ilaha illallah, Wallahu akbar, Walla hawla wa la quwwata illa billah al baqiyat al salihat. Imam Ibrahim al Nakhai, he said, saying Subhanallah one time in Ramadan is like saying Subhanallah a thousand times outside of Ramadan. So as you go through your daily activities, be that work, be that nursing a child, be that whatever it may be, and your tongue is moist with the remembrance of Allah. Think of the reward that's accruing to you because of the blessings of Ramadan. Ramadan's ajib, brothers and sisters. It is amazing. It is amazing for everyone. And we pray we all make it to the day of Eid when the prizes are distributed. And the ultimate prize of that day is liberation from the fire of hell. So Imam Zayd Shakir, on behalf of Tetlif Collective, thanking all of you for your support, thanking you for taking the time to view this brief video, and asking Allah subhanahu wa ta'ala to continue to bless all of you during the balance of this incredible month. Assalamu alaikum wa rahmatullahi wa barakatuh.